Hey ladies, hope you had a great week. Um, I'm coming at you today with a scenario. Imagine it is Friday or Saturday night when your girlfriend calls you up and says, Girl, I just got this ticket to this Neo Soul concert and your hair looks something like mine does right now. Now I love my hair, but this doesn't have any, you know, one side is a little bigger than the other and it, it's not really a twist out, it's, it's just kind of all over the place. I would have to fix this and I would have to do so quickly. So what would I do? Well, I'm about to wash my hair so I, you know, sometimes I play in my hair a little bit before I wash it. I would get some bobby pins. Bobby pins, as you know, are like, you just need to have bobby pins. They are essential in any girl's life. And I would do the soup hawk. I call it the soup hawk. Um, I call it the soup hawk because it's kind of like the fro hawk. Um, but the hair isn't all going down the middle. It's all going to one side. So you can do either side. Um, this just this is the side that I choose to work on. And you get your bobby pins and you just pin the hair holding it in place. And just keep plugging away. And you want to overlap it. So where the last pin ended, I'm not doing a good job of it, I can really feel it. You want to start a little bit at that place where the last uh, bobby pin ended and continue along. And if you miss a spot or something is loose, you can always go back and fix it. So it's not a big deal. And you just continue. So I'm looking in the mirror and some stuff is kind of sticking out a little funny. So all of that stuff you, you deal with along the way. And um, you can, they're the big pins like these ones. Sometimes I use them if I run out of body pins, but especially with natural hair because it's so thick. I find that like my hair kind of overwhelms the bobby pin so you can't really see it that well and see all up in my hair which is good you don't want to show up the bobby pins you want to show off the front and then you you're not moving this to the middle the way you would with the frohawk, hawk but you just kind of kind of raise it I use this one um, just because it's really not going to show because the hair is going to flop right over, you see? Um, and you don't have to put pins there if you don't want to, but I like to because, I don't know, it just gives it a, a look that I like. And, you know, and you just fiddle with the hair, look in the mirror, make sure things look the way you want it to look. And that's pretty much it. Um, this is like, it wasn't even a twist out, kind of. I pulled the twist out and I wore it in a bun. Um, but you can see little curls here and there, you know. And then you just get some cute earrings. Uh, this is a shout out, by the way, to Black Onyx. These are her ringleader earrings. You can put in Black Onyx on YouTube and you can see our natural hair videos if you haven't already. And voila, from interesting old twist out slash roll to kind of funky and cool. And you can just see yourself wearing this on a summer night with girls. Um, I'll turn around. And that really didn't take any time. So just because you need to go out and your hair is looking a little crazy doesn't mean you have to settle for the old bun or head wrap or scarf or whatever. It's cool if you want to, but you can do something funky too. Alright, have a great weekend ladies.